All right, you are welcome to this lesson. And in this lesson, I'll be showing you or explaining to you in details what is known as the elemental sections and also structures. For us to better understand what we are talking about, let's get to the page, all right? In our previous lesson, we already edited that page we created using the Elementor page builder. And then we came to this particular page, okay? And also, we set our page layout to be Elementor Canvas. That is why we are having this blank page this way. Okay? Now, if you hover your mouse to this option, we have two, these two um, elements we are seeing here. One is a folder. It's telling us to add template. Okay? And then the other one says that we can add new section. Now, if you already have a pre-built template you can add it up from this folder but we are not going to be seeing that in these lectures we are going to be seeing that at the towards the end of the class and then um, now if you click on the plus sign if you have to add a new section you click on this plus sign but once you click on that plus sign there's another form that will come up you know asking you to choose your structure so a section allows you to add a structure it therefore means that you are adding a structure to a section all right okay we are going to better understand this as we go along now let's take for example that we want to add some an element to a page okay you are going to be looking at what is called the elements letter now you click on this a section and in this section we have different types we have the full section right now if you click on here we have the it takes the full width of the whole screen now when you click on this again we have another structure that divides it into two so that we can add an element to the left or we add another element to the right now you can do the same for three you know three structures you can repeat the same for four different structures so it's breaking our sections into four different structures where you can place different elements in each of these four sections right so in our next lesson we are going to be working with the element what is called the element in elemental page builder